Hey, I'm just Vosco and we're back in City Skylines and Victoria Park, which we placed down last time, is looking beautiful. Really nice. I love how these houses sit together. They are a, they are upgrading, which is nice. We've added a tiny little little here. Audi. Audi, get it right. A tiny little Audi. Because that's what you'd expect. And we are going to put a big supermarket over here. I'm noticing we're getting a lot of lorries now. A lot. If we come down here. Actually, that's better than it was. That's a lot better than it was. Why, why are you a lot better? Oh, what's the matter with you? You don't have enough crops. Oh, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Let's have a look at this. So you're not importing any, which is good. We could probably give you some more fields. I feel like you're in a really awkward position here. No, because the city's going to go down that way. Maybe you're not. Maybe you're not in an awkward position. Maybe we can live with that. So if we go to here, we now have these big farms. We need to expand our area a little bit more. Um, so your industry, right? Yes, you are. Perfect. Nice fields. We don't have much greenery over this way. So, let's go to... Ah, oh, you haven't got any... You don't have any zoning on you, but we can fix that. We can go force zoning. We can select this road here. And then if I do that, it forces zoning on there. Perfect. Excellent. Happy. Good. Back to here. So now, I suppose, actually, we should probably... We should probably disable zoning again now. And we should continue this road up here along this ridge. Which we seem to be creating. But that's fine. I don't mind a bit of a ridge. Now you can go there and there. This one may be too far out of... Wait, I need to move you a bit so you line up better. Yeah, if you go there, that works for me. You need water. I can do that. I can absolutely do that. Where's my water pipe? Oh, let's just... Oh, let's go to there and then let's skip through there. So that's fine. You've got water. So that's a couple more fields for you. I am actually tempted to carry this road on here. And then we can run it along the back. Wait, where, where is our farming area? So it's nice and green over here. Yeah, we're running out of farming zone. Because we've taken up a lot of it with this fake field. Which is a little annoying. Wait, what if I select both of you? Like that. Select both of you and then we move you. We could do that, right? We could just move you over to here. And then we'll just try and get you in there so you look somewhat right. Is that somewhat right? Somewhat. Yes. Okay. You need water still. Why do you need water? Oh, why have we not got water coming down here? Oh, there we go. There we go. Now you should be happy. You're not happy. I don't know why you're not happy. Do we need another pumping station? We do. Oh, that could be an issue. Maybe, maybe we'll just put a water tower over on the farm. That seems like a good option. We could put one just in there like that. And then do that. Because we're not getting pollution over here, right? Farms don't do pollution as far as I know. And then you can go in there and there. We'll come out of that. And we'll move you together. So you feel like more of one farm. I wish I could remove the buildings from this. And I want you to be potatoes. Yes, do potatoes. Potatoes like so. Okay. You've got you've got some crops now, which is good. I'm tempted to grab you and you. And we're going to duplicate you. Flip you round like that. And just plop you in there. Just like that. Yes, I know you need a road connection. We are going to do that now. 
So if I can bring that road, turn snapping off for a second. Go away snapping. Then you, sir, can come through here to there. And then we'll just move you slightly so you line up with the fields a bit nicer. There we go. That's lovely. Okay, so we've ended up with quite a big field. A little fake field over here. Not so much. We need to do a bit of work up here. So you can come through there like that. You can go across there. I know you're not lined up, but we're going to work. We're, we're just going to move this one slightly. Just till it looks right. A bit like that. And I'm going to extend you and then we'll delete. We'll delete a little bit of you. Once we've got you where we need you. So I need this road, please. Thank you. And you're going to come through here, right? Yes. Okay. And we'll use the move it mod just to nudge that slightly. Like that. Perfect. And then we can delete that road. And then this road here, we're going to delete. And then we're just going to draw it in again. So you need to come off of there onto here. Perfect. Again, using the move it mod just to line it up a little bit nicer. Just like that. Yeah, that's, that's quite an odd road, but there we go. So our field's back in. We can definitely get rid of these bushes. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I should have just used the tree, the tree tool. I should have just done that in the first place. Let's grab that one. Let's duplicate it. And we'll bring you back in like that. There we go. Okay. So our farm is growing extremely well over here. Really well. Love it. Don't like that tree line now. We definitely need to get rid of that. Just, just get rid of those trees. Those two are okay. They can stay. So hopefully that will help our industry as well as our farm. Let's see what's going on. Total profit 173. We are importing at the moment. Well, I'm hoping once these fields kick in, we won't have that issue. Do I want to put another silo down this way? Probably. Can we get a silo over here? No, because you don't have zoning. Wait, we can, we can fix that. If I select you, force zoning, do that like so. Lovely. And then we can put a couple of silos on there like that. Yeah. Happy. Good. So Lily Lane Farm is doing amazing. Uh, Luna Farm, not so much. We are going to look at that at some point. Congratulations. Lily Lane Farm has reached level four. We've got a clothing factory, a, a farm maintenance building, a large barn and a slaughterhouse. A farm maintenance building. What does that do? Where are you? So we've got a large barn. I feel like that would probably be something that would be useful. So we could put that there. Just like that. That actually sits in there really nicely. Where is the farm maintenance building? What do you do? Maintenance building. Take care of industri industrial buildings. Increasing their utility rate and reduction wastage. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, we'll have one of those. Why not? Where is all our buildings? Our buildings are over this way. Can I put... Do I want you there? Or do I want... Here would be good, actually. Just there. Yes. Lovely. Okay. We do... We get factories as well. I haven't even looked at factories. So we got a bakery, which needs flour, wheat, and crops. Uh, flour, wheat, and crops. It needs meat, crops, and flour. So we're doing flour and crops. We're not really doing meat. So maybe the other farm could do meat and we can add a bakery then. Lemonade factory needs glass. We're definitely not at that point. Cloven factory. Again, I don't think we can do that quite yet. Oh, and we got a bento factory, which is the same as the, same as the bakery. So we could put both of those in at some point. We just need to get our meat production up and running. Do we, we have upgraded? We've 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 gone to the next level. We are now a busy town. So we've got sightseeing bus, trolley bus, leisure and tourism, unique buildings. Um, 
have we got trains yet? I feel like we should have trains at this point. Metro trains. No, we can build an airport, but we can't build trains. That seems a bit odd to me, if I'm honest. I have put another bus route in as well, going the opposite direction to the other one. Oh, we definitely need a bus route up here and we probably need a bus route over here. But ultimately, I would like a bus station somewhere. Maybe over here by, by where we're going to build the train station. That would probably make sense. What are you? You're a tram depot. Where do I get a bus station? Ferry bus exchange. No, I just want a bus station. <laughs> Ooh. Trolley bus depot. Nope. This one then. Yes. So we've got a... That's quite a big bus station. We may need a smaller one than that. That seems quite large although not completely out of the question we do have this bit of land here we could use next to that park oh i'm tempted now i'm tempted to put a bus station in there i'm getting distracted i was going to do my supermarket but if we put a bus station there ready that is quite a modern one i know people you're not happy I know we're going to get rid of that house and that house and that house. And there's car parking behind here, is there? Yes. Okay, so we really need to change this slightly. How about we get rid of that house? Uh, we'll reduce that road. Can I get to that road? No, I can't. Okay, so we're going to we're going to delete that road for a second. Then we're going to I don't know, grab probably the rural road. I, I, I sort of like that for back, back roads like this. And you need to come through here, right? Like so. Is that good? It does look good. Yes. So then you can come that way a bit. You can shimmy up there. And you can go there. Happy with that. Okay. I'm actually tempted to continue that road this way slightly. Put snapping back on for me, please. Thank you very much. And then you can come down the side of here. Are you going to allow me? Actually, you, you could go there. That would work. And then we could just fill this in with, with concrete. Like so. Yeah, do you know what? Don't hate that. This is our little, wait, they've got a little, little cafe, is that? With a little seating area. That's very nice. So you guys, sadly, are now sort of right next to a busy bus station. Which you probably hate, but it is a modern times. New buildings come along. We'll try and protect you as much as we can. If I, can you go there? Go on, you know you want to. You know you want to go along there. You don't want to go along there. Okay. Let's put them individually then, shall we? Will that allow me to do it? Yes. Yes, it will. There we go. See, I'm protecting you a little bit, houses. Just a little bit. And that can come... Oh, we've got all these ugly trees. I don't like these big trees, if I'm honest. Let's get rid of them, shall we? Because this is becoming a, a built-up area. What's that then? Oh, that's a circle tool. We don't want that. We want this brush. We want to get rid of these like that lovely okay then we can go back to this one and we can continue this all the way along like so and i'm actually tempted to continue it there for no apparent reason and they may disappear at some point this path here i love how we got the housing on this path how they get onto the driveway who knows can i have to move it tall and just move you over slightly just like that then in here, we probably could just paint it. We could probably just grab that, fill that in like that, which may have filled... Oh, no, we didn't. We did okay. Then we'll grab some trees. Uh, leafy tree. I do like the leafy tree. Put you back down to one. And then we'll just put a couple of trees along here like that. Yeah, there we go. So now, bus lines, where are you lot going? You're going, so I think you should come here. How do I do that? If I'm correct, I can just click and drag. So if I grab you, 
into here, for example. Where are you going? Why are you going up there? Oh, because it's the... Wait, wait, wait. Let's change the road then, because you need to be able to cross this road. Huh. What? I'm tempted to use this one. Or a bigger one, actually. What if we go for... Have we got a grass virgie one? Um, let's have a look. That one, maybe, because we don't want parking on it. That's, that's a definite. So we could do that. That seems like that would work. Let's see if that does work. Because they can definitely cross this road. Right? I know it's double white lines, which would normally mean you're not allowed to cross. But let's see what that does for our buses. So if I grab, where's that stop gone? That stop and bring you into here. Now you're still going to do it. Urgh. That's a little annoying. A little annoying. Uh, let's grab that one again. Is it because I haven't done this piece? Or are you, you're just not allowed to cross that road, are you? Well, poopity poop. Oh, that's massive. That that road is huge. Is there a road that we can go across? That one? Oh, that's cobbled. We probably don't want cobbled. What's this one? That's huge as well. That one... Oh, I don't know. What about that one? Can you cross... No, see? It's double... It doesn't like you to cross the roads here. Uh, rural road, you probably could. And that one, you probably could as well. But that just looks silly. I don't want that one. I think we're just going to have to live with it. If I take that road, we'll put you there and there. And possibly there. Yeah, but we'll go there as well. Like so. They're going to come up here, it said, didn't they? So that might not be a bad plan, actually. If we go... Oh, no, don't don't upgrade that. No, I wanted the clicky clicky, that one. So now we'll upgrade that road and then we'll come along here. And this could just be a turnaround for the buses. Can you turn snapping off so you come straight? Like that? I feel like... That's okay. Maybe this should be one way. Maybe it should just be buses. Do I have bus roads? Let's have a look. Uh, not little ones like that, no. Okay, that's fine. We'll leave it like that. Those trees make no sense there now, but they will. Then we'll go back to here. We're going to grab that bus stop there. And we're going to bring it into here. Yeah, so that should work. If I bring you into there, and we're going to put a stop back there, then we're going to bring you into there. So you're going to go up and round, yes. And then we'll put the stop back in there as well. I think that would work. I don't like this. It's a little annoying, but until we get loads of buses coming in here, it should be okay. Now, let's do another route. So we're going to go from here. I think we should go up to the main road. Or we could, no, we could go up this road. That's fine. So we're going to click there. Then we're going to click there. So we're going to stop at the same bus stops. And we're going to come into our new estate. So we should, we should stop somewhere near that Audi. Stopping there is probably a bad idea, right? What if we came in to here, turned round and stopped right outside? Then we could come up here. Up to there. Yes, okay. How are we going to get into the rest of the estate? I have no idea. Because we've just skipped half of it. Ooh. Don't know, don't know, don't know. If we cut, I want a road there, really. You could come up to there. 
And that, then they're sandwiched between two bus stops. I don't entirely hate that idea. It does miss a lot of the estate, though. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Go back here. We are going to change this for a road, I think. We're going to get rid of that path. We're going to grab a tiny little road. Maybe a one-way road. Maybe a, that would work. Then you can come off there. Oh, don't delete that house. Don't do that. Okay, delete the house then. That's fine. We can use the move it mod just to shimmy you back up. Do a copy. Uh, no, that one. Copy it. Place it there. Um, and I am going to place two here. The gardens are going to overlap, but I can I can live with that for the time being. This is what I mean by dynamic gardens. Like these gardens should just automatically meet up. That would be really cool. Okay, so back to the buses. So now you can go through here, right? So if I take you... Oh, see, that doesn't even... That's the odor state, right? Yeah, that's the odor state. You can come through... Oh, no. That one. If you just do a loop of the estate, actually, you could come through there, down here, and then back on your way. Because they can walk to Aldi. They do not need to get a bus to Aldi. And then you can come back up this way. Along this main road here. And then back into the bus station. Like so. Excellent. Now let's go to here. We want to make... No, that one, please. We want to make sure you're the stagecoach buses. Which is that one. Perfect. You're going to get under your way, and we should probably have a bus that sort of services this area. Do we? Maybe not at the moment, because that is quite close to the bus station. So that should be okay. Let's close all of this. Get rid of that. Press play. The buses are coming in. That's good. There are already people waiting now, which is amazing. This is the only issue when you get buses queued up out onto the main road. That, well, keep an eye on it. If it becomes too much of an issue, we'll try and rearrange how the front works. Look at all the buses. You're going to queue up behind that one, right? Oh, no, you've got to turn around first. Oh, so that gives that one time to move. Yep, don't hate that. Don't hate that at all. Okay, you need electric. Are we out of electricity? We are. Wow, okay. So a little... We've got two coal power stations. They're not doing it for us. What is that? Geothermal... Wait, shell sign... That's power. Okay. Do we have anywhere we can put wind turbines? Not really, no. Okay, so we can't go with that. Co-power plants produce what? Output 40. Oil 120. I'm guessing the pollution's more. No, the pollution's less on oil. Oh, so what's this one? Power plant uses uh, utilizes the warmth in the Earth's, Earth's core to provide electricity for the city. No pollution does have a bit of noise pollution. What does that look like? Oh, it's a big, big old thing. But we could put that with our water plant. We could put that down here. It has a tiny bit of noise pollution. But wait, wait, let's do that. I know you're not happy, people. I know I'm going to make it. I'm going to make it pretty for you. So you move that way. A lot, actually. You could go right up to there. Which sort of fits in nicely with that road. And then we're going to grab this. And we're just going to colour this area in like that. Because ultimately, this doesn't need to be grass, right? This could just be all painted. A bit like that. Where is that power line going? Is that... Oh, it's bringing power from there. So it is probably needed at the time being. You're not happy, and I don't blame you. I don't blame you in the slightest. 
Uh, fencing. I was in the right one. Fences here. Let's grab a big... What is that? Retaining wall. No, not that. Some... Oh, sound barrier. Let's have a look what that looks like. Oh, it's quite... Quite nice. It's almost like they've put some effort into protecting the houses nearby. Yes, okay, I can live with that. And if people live live here who work here, they'd like a little path through, right? You think that would be something they would like? So if I grabbed you and then just joined you onto here, would you people like that? Would people walk down here? We will see, I suppose. And then along here, we'll put we'll, just to try and silence the noise as much as possible. Uh, let's put some trees. Uh, look, we might do this individually. That might be much easier. There we go. Some lovely... Oh, we put a lot there. Lovely trees. Mix it up a bit. Get some smaller ones in there. Uh, thinner ones. We got some smaller thin ones. Yes, we have. Perfect. Yeah, see, it's not too bad. I know it's not ideal, but I feel like this is like quite an industrial area. We've got the massive train station. We've got all the like terraced housing. These aren't actually what I would expect for industrial workers, train train workers and things. They'd be much less grand than this. These are quite grand terraced houses. But I like to spoil my residents. What's wrong with that? So you're good. This shop hates me, which I can understand why, because it has no road, no road whatsoever. Which means we may have to delete it. Or, wait, can we change... Oh, I didn't get it. I was going to get the, thing, the mod that allows me to say where the lorries come, because if we could say round the back, that means they could use this road, right? Realistic population, I don't think, I, no, I didn't. I will get it at some point and fix that building. That should do the trick. Wow. Um, okay. Now, a lot of you are in this lane to keep going round, right? Yeah, see, we can fix that. If we force this lane to be that way, then anyone who doesn't want to go that way will have to come up this inside lane. Like that person just did. That person just changed lanes because they want to go around. Perfect. Okay. Buses are doing well. Is there lots of people? Oh, wow. There is a l Oh. Excuse me, Mr. Bus. You, you miss these people. Oh, you don't come down this way. Never mind. Buses are pot. Oh, see, this is an issue. The buses are... We need a different road. Oh, oh, actually, when there's one bus there, it's fine. It's when there's multiple buses like there is right now. That's what's going to hold up things. They do look lovely, though, those buses. Really nice. They take ages to pick people up. Move, man, move. There is literally a bus behind you. Why are we missing bushes on our circle? I don't know. Um, duplicate. There we go. Lovely. And one there. Yes. Happy. Good. Traffic's not building up, though. It is flowing. The amount of buses coming down here may be a problem. We may have to look at changing this for a bus lane. Which we can absolutely do. <laughs> Excuse me. We can absolutely do that. But that's going to annoy... Wait, is that going to be the same site? Ooh, no, it's going to delete all the houses. Oh, that's so annoying. I wish I could not delete the houses. Because they should fit in there fine. There's no reason it it wouldn't. Well, okay. We may live with that for the time being. So what we're going to look at now, we're going to look at the supermarket. So what supermarket do we have? Do we have an Asda? Yes. Is that a big... It is a big, big Asda. I love it. Okay. So this road's going to have to not be a country lane now. I feel like this road needs upgrading at this point. So what I'm thinking is... 
It is. It doesn't need to be a big road. Let's do that for the time being. All the way along. And it's going to go into the country. I can live with that. Here. Somewhere along here. We want to put a, a turning lane to go into Asda. So we need that one there. If I do that. We'll flip you round. So anyone coming up this road. Then has a turning lane. No that's the wrong way. Anyone coming up this road now has a turning lane to go right. Then we'll go back down to here. We're going to grab that from that point. Is that going to work? Yes. Excellent. Okay. Because not be funny. Residents aren't really going to go go over here, I don't think. So is that good? Are we going to get our Asda in there? Oh yeah. Yes. Yeah, easy. We want a lot of car park as well though, right? Plus, do I want Asda on this side? That would make more sense to me in the car park all in here. He says. Because they're going to want a backstage delivery area. Luna Farm, I think your time... Maybe running short. I just feel Asda needs more space. Yeah, do you know what? I wish we could. Could we move you anywhere? I don't know. <laughs> Let's go to farms. Where is our nearest farming area? That's really good, that farming. So we could just push you back. And we can buy a new square. I'm tempted to buy this square here. Which is the opposite direction to what I want to go. I want to go down to the waterfront. But. Let's do it. Let's buy that. Because I don't particularly want to lose Luna Farm. This is the first time I've seen these. This junction now. So this comes down to here. Oh and it comes onto a roundabout. Oh that's really nice. Really nice. And this is the motorway. Which ultimately should be a UK motorway. Which would be all set as one, right? Because that's one piece. Yeah. Okay, we're not going to mess with that. We're going to leave it as it is. We are going to move you though. So. This is quite... Where are we going to go from? I'm actually tempted to go off one of these slip roads, but that would be a terrible idea, right? He says, I don't think it would be a terrible idea. I think if we grabbed a country road. Just a, it, it doesn't need to be one way because they can only go one direction. Any, oh, yeah, we'll make it one way. We'll make it one way. Country road, one direction, that one. And if we come off there like that, just so when they come off the motorway, they can slip down this lane here. Like that. Then we'll grab a two-way one. And we'll bring that up this way. Can we have a bit of a bend on it? And you can go over into that corner for no apparent reason. You can come down there. Happy with that. Now I want to grab that one-way road again. And we're going to put you onto a junction here. Yeah. So they don't have to come up into this main area. If they go into this farm, they can sort of hop off there. They will have to come back through that way. But that's okay. I don't mind that too much. Then we're going to grab this road again. And we need a connection down here. So if you come to that. If you come straight across there. Then you can come down where those trees are. To there. You can join on. To there like that. He says. Excellent. Okay. So let's expand your area. Lunar farm. You're going to come over to here now. This is all going to be your field. Like that. Happy. Good. 
Now we'll cut this back. I know you're not happy. Bear with. Let's move you onto that road for the time being. We'll grab a decent road now. What do I want to put you on? I, I reckon you'd have a proper road coming into the, the farmyard area. Something like that. I think that would probably be something you would have. So if then we're going to grab you. We're going to put you on there like that. Which I don't hate. What else have we got? We've got the barracks. I quite like that as it is. So how about we grab that road again? Put a road down there. And we can have all like our living accommodation area at the front there. So let's grab you. We'll move you across. Uh, to there. We'll grab you. Move you across to there. And then use the move it mod just to... Hello? Go away. I wish to move this one. Like, ah, oh, you're not going to be connected. Wait, wait. Come on, you know you want to. There we go, perfect. Then we could just... I could probably just grab that one and just bring it across. And we'll pull it behind the farmhouse. Like so. And then we'll get the fields over here as well. So, how do we want the fields to go? I'm going to go with, because I do like the bush, the, the, the road is covered with trees either side, like that. Force zoning. You're going to come down this way. Then you're going to go up here along this tree line. Yeah, okay. Then we're going to grab you and move you onto here. We can use the move it mod in a second. We're going to grab you as well. Oh. What did I do there? I have absolutely no idea. Perfect. Just like that. I want another one of these, I think. Can I have an... Oh, that's not it. Okay. It does weird things when you use the picker mod on the fields. Let's put another one of you in like that. And maybe another one. Perfect. We want you to be the same. So what are you growing? Potatoes. Potatoes, please. Potatoes for the pigs. Because this is going to become a meat farm. So can we light... No, go away. Move it. And then I want you... Oh, don't, don't change what level you are. That would just... Why? Wait, if I do that, and then we're going to go to object height, that one. Are you all the same height now? You are. Excellent. Then we can grab this road here. Because the plan here is just to make it look like this is surrounded by roads. Like so. Which I don't hate that. I love the fact it hides that ridge almost perfectly. You to there. Lovely. We will move you slightly that way. And move you slightly that way. Oh, we've almost got like an entrance to the field. Just a natural entrance. That worked out beautifully. Yes. Okay, turn move it mod off. Then we're going to grab the silo. Because that definitely is more needed over here than there. Where do I want that? Probably in the main area there. And I'll grab that one as well. And we'll move that one across. And I'm quite liking the idea of some greenhouses in the center. Like so. Then finally we got those three fields. Which could. Could go on this back. Yeah they could go on here. So if I leave a bit of a gap and then go there. There. This is going to confuse all the. All the lorries right. That's what's going to happen here. Like so. Then we'll quickly grab a bit of road, bring you up there, and then you up here, and across the top, 
Yes, use the move it mod just to stretch that out a little bit. Perfect. Uh, you. Excellent. And finally, you. Wait, why has that field got a gap in it? I don't want a gap. Yes, okay. Then that one. We'll move Nat. We'll move we'll move it properly. Ooh. Ooh. Can I fit you in there? Because that would be really nice if I could. Is that like if I just jiggle you about a bit, will you fit? Do you know what? It does fit perfectly. Then you you move just slightly. Yes, I love that. That looks so good. What else have we got over here? We got another silo, which I'm thinking should. Where, where are they? They're there. We don't want to put too much traffic over there. We could put it on the field. Again, that would work. Don't hate that idea. And then I think that's it, right? So then we can reduce this area. Right about like that. It is going to need water and electric. Which is understandable because I have just moved you completely. Water to there. Up there. Lovely. You can go across there. I'm not even going to be cheap with my piping. I'm going to give you lots of piping. Because I can. You're going to be our money makers. That's the plan. Lovely. Is that going to connect up? Hope. Oh no, we haven't actually connected it to a water source. So you just come across here like that then. And now you're going to need electric. So we're probably just going to put a little substation in. 5 megawatts, 5 megawatts. You cost upkeep of 4, upkeep of 8. Oh, we'll go with a cheap one then. Cheap makes sense to me. And we'll put you there. So that should be enough power to run all of that, he says. Hello? Is that an... Oh, it's alive. There we go. So the farm is now moved, which means all of this area can go. And that is, that's where Lunar Farm is going to live now. It's not going... We're not moving it again. I love the idea of the farms being by the motorway here. Motorway stroke bypass or whatever you want to call this. Bypass. We could come straight off that roundabout and sort of ignore the city completely if they want to come down this way. Or the, actually they can do that anyway because it tunnels underneath. Ignore me. Right, Asda. Let's get rid of these trees first off. We'll make a little bit of space. Just so we can see what's going on. Do I hate those trees? Yes. <laughs> They're going. There we go. They've gone. We are now going to go and grab our Asda finally. Finally going to put a supermarket in. Like that. Let's grab this road. And I feel like it could go around this way. Just a little bit. And then we can get a back road, which again, probably the, oh, I don't know, that one, that one will be fine. This is for the lorries to get in. So I reckon they turn, they wouldn't even go into the car park area. They would come up here and round the back. Which actually works out, we could put a warehouse back here or some storage area for the supermarket. So yeah, that's where the lorries would go. And out the front, we'd have to have loads of car parking. Like, tons of it. So if we use this little road. What if I did that, right? And then we're going to grab the car park. I know I've got the road car parks. But I feel like we need a bigger one than that. I feel like we need a lot of these. So if I do that. Actually, maybe not that one. Because that's going to be off. Where we want it. Uh, can I have some view please? Yes I can. Pick an object to. Yeah so you. You're going to come over here. You're going to go. No I want that one. 
That one's going to go there. That one's going to go in here. Like so. Then we can go and click both of those and duplicate it. And rotate that round just like that. Perfect. And probably again. Like so. And these didn't line up exactly how I wanted them. Go in there. Yep, that works. And then I can use the move it on this one and this one. And we'll just try and get those lined up with the others. Perfect. You, sir. This little one-way road now can come straight down there. Across the back here. No, don't snap, please. That's good. Which means they've now got a connection. Might be a bit tight coming through here, but we'll give it a go. Like that. I'm actually tempted just to make this a little bit smaller. Like that. And then we want the one-way street again. And I want you to come back onto this road. Perfect. Okay. Let's select that. We're going to move you to there. Because I want, I want this road to feel like part of the car park. Yeah, that works. That works really nicely. Now... Other things we'd find here would be like a McDonald's, right? Uh, McDonald's. Yep, we got a McDonald's restaurant, which, again, is perfect. I reckon they'd have built this here. They probably would have had a tiny little car park of their own. Like that. I like it. Do they want a little outside seating area? I think they do. Just a little one, just over here. I know it's got seating on the roof, but if we just do that and then we'll grab the, the cementing tool, as I call it, because that's all I ever use it for. Turn you down a bit. Cement that in so they've got a little seating area. Yes, it looks a bit rough, but that's fine. We can, we can sort that with trees. We can add... We can add... If you come down to here, like that, and then along here. And I think I want you to curve at that point to there. And then come up to there. Yeah, I'm happy with that. And then we could do sort of like a backstage area back here for bins and things. Travel Lodge. That's what we need. It's coming into the city from the motorway here. So this is almost an ideal place to put a travel lodge. Let's plop it down, then we'll sort of move it around and see what we can do with it. Why have you got a fence on you? That's a little annoying. And you're facing the wrong way. Let's turn you around this way. Like so. Are you going to fit? That car parking on the front's a little... It's not going to fit there, is it? Oh, that's... That makes me a little sad. There is a lot coming in here now. Okay, may, do I want it over here? I feel like you wouldn't drive past the Asda to get to it. Like, you're driving through Asda's car park here. That's what I feel. Um, let's find something else we could plop in. They wouldn't sort of be in direct competition with Asda. They probably would allow certain things to build over here. Oh, Morrison's. That's an... We don't need another supermarket. Uh, maybe an Odeon. Like a cinema. Odeon Cinema. And Curry's PC World, probably. Because, let's be fair, that's not going to compete with Asda. We could just do that. Just a couple. They're not going to have good access for their lorries. But uh, they are going to have a lot of people sort of bought in because of Asda. So if we move you forward a bit. We definitely cannot get an access road for the lorries. But that's fine. 
I do try when I can. Instead, we're just going to put bushes behind you. Just like that. All the way along here. He says. If the bushes do what he wants them to do. Stop, please. I wish for you to bend that way. Yeah, that's it. Perfect. Thank you very much. And then here, I'm going to say we'll just have the bushes going straight across. What's going on? Give me my bushes back. There, across here. Yeah, that works for me. Look at the traffic coming out of here. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. That's an issue that I didn't consider. You know what that means? That means we need a roundabout. Oh, I do like a good roundabout. Should work, right? I don't want time traffic lights, he says. No, I don't want time traffic lights. I want a roundabout. Where's my roundabout builder gone? Hello? <laughs> it's gone. You're not what I want. I don't know. I don't know where it's gone. It's vanished. Okay, we'll have to make our own then. I can do that. I'm, I'm a professional builder. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. Uh, where is my roundabout pieces? There. Probably a three-lane roundabout. Oh. That means I've got to take all this out. Do you know what? I'm going to cheat. I'm going to go, do you know, let's try time traffic lights and see how they get on. And if not, then we'll put a roundabout in there. But for me to build a roundabout, I'm going to have to put a cross in and then, yeah. Yeah. We'll see what happens. Dedicated turn-in lanes might be a good idea. So, if I grab that one, and then we duplicate that to here. But we would turn it that way. So then you're, you've got, ooh, ooh, Elizabeth Gardens has reached level three. So we've got gazebos now. That's good. That's very good. So now you've got to turn it. Yeah, so we should have dedicated turn-in lanes here. So if I go to this... Um, click control click, I think it is. And that just makes dedicated turning lanes. So I reckon that actually might sort out the problem. There is a lot of people walking down this road now. Where are they crossing? Here, I presume. Yeah, very much so. Very much crossing there. Do you know what? A pathway through from... This area might be a good idea. And then I should really stop playing because these videos get far too long. Because they just sort of go, oh, we could do this and we could do this and this and this. I'm going to make it a nice tree-lined one. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm going to do it there. And then I'm going to use the move it mod so it doesn't delete the houses. No, stop it. You're going to come through. Hello. <laughs> Select what I want you to. And you are going to come through here. That means the houses can stay then. And then we just need to move some of these bushes. That one. Over there. That one. Over there. Perfect. Little overgrown uh, walkway. I like it. Which will give, them, give the people who live here a better access anyway. They're not going to have to walk all the way around the main road. Uh-oh. We've caused issues. It's definitely looking like this needs to be a traffic light. Uh, a, a roundabout. Or we need to find another way of these lorries getting back onto the motorway. Which might possibly be a better idea. We could do a bigger roundabout here. Get rid of that roundabout. Bring that road down. Yes, that might be a better idea. We'll check that out in the next episode. For now, they're just going to have to put up with all the traffic. If you've enjoyed this episode, hit that like button. If you haven't done already, please subscribe. It does help the channel. And until next time, I'll see you again.